What's up, YouTube? As you guys know, my name is Cameron Boy, and I'm here with a brand new Let's Play. It is called Let's Play Red Dead Redemption Undead Nightmare. Let us begin. This is going to be a great Let's Play. It's going to be a blast. Let's hope I don't, um... It's kind of, um... Wait, what? New game. Game. Yes. Alright, let's do this. I totally hope I don't pee my pants. Alright, so I'm going to set the goal for this video at 50 views, 5 likes, and 2 comments. Which I know we can do. And while you're at it, why don't you go down there and click the subscribe button. Alright, let's listen. Game. After months away, John Marston has returned to his loved ones. While trying to rebuild his ranch and win back the trust of his family, Marston awaits whatever life will throw at him. As he drives home one evening from an errand, he ponders whether a man can ever escape his past. He is a man who is ready for anything. Almost anything. <laughs> Rockstar Games presents. I probably just blew up your mics. A Rockstar San Diego production. I guess that's where they make all their expansion. Red Dead Redemption, Undead Nightmare. Mother. Oh, I'm sorry. I meant to say, damn this awful son I've raised with his highfalutin ways and his shame that his mother swears like a sailor and sews like a blind man. Uh, is that better? Your lordship. Much better, mother dearest. Oh, good. I'm so glad, my darling. When you've finished your university education and are far too good to even acknowledge my existence when we pass on the street, and you gently kick me aside and beg an old crow out of the way with your highly polished boot. Well, think of me kindly at least, will you, my son? I'll try to, mother. I'll think, that woman I just kicked, that used to be my dear old potty mouth mom. Maybe I should bother to kick her harder. <laughs> dear boy. Oh, I am so proud of you. Get off. Now, father's here. Maybe he can beat some sense into you. Something funny's going on out there. Damn dogs gone crazy and wolves howling and birds flying. Well, it's just the storm, John. Maybe. Uncle make it back yet? I thought he was with you off drinking in the fields. I mean working, as you call it now. Uh, he went into town a few hours ago after we busted that hammer working out in the meadow. Well, he's probably holed up in some place of ill repute waiting for the passing of the storm. I hope so. Ah! Well, that old man can take care of himself. I know. Just a funny feeling I got. You gone psychic, Paul? Either that or I ate something funny. <laughs> Knowing your mother's cooking. Seems more than likely. Mm. Well, talking about food, who's ready for some poisoning? <laughs> Me, my darling. I am starving. What you reading? Just some book about monsters. Tell me about it. It's kind of dumb. <laughs> that should suit me just fine. Well, it's all about 
in ancient times how Aztec warriors worshipped the sun, but during full moons, some of them worshipped the moon instead and upset the equilibrium of things. So anyway, what it involves is there's this one guy, and he goes out to search of his him all alone. So anyways, since there ain't no cure, the brave man has to kill everybody, which is absolutely disgusting and completely unbelievable. <laughs> it's getting late. Guess we're not going to see Uncle till morning. Come on then, Abigail. <sighs> Jack, get yourself to bed, boy. Try to get some sleep. Ain't you worried about Uncle? Sure, but he'll have to wait till morning just like any other man would in his shoes. Good night, son. Don't stay up reading too late. Wow. It's high tech for their time. They got like lights. <laughs> oh, what's up, Uncle? Hey, how's it going? You don't look so good. You're uh, looking kind of like. God. Uh, you just came back from the grave or something. What the hell is wrong with you? And there went that lamp. Come on, man, that costs like 10 bucks. <laughs> Where are you going? Where are you going? To get my gun. Oh, you should always keep a gun by your bed, bro. Who uses a lamp to kill a zombie? Really, who uses a lamp to kill his... Admit... Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uncle! You dumb son of a bitch! Stop! <laughs> Put Uncle out of his misery. Obliged. Dead eye mode! Somebody puts their hands on my wife! <laughs> I can't believe I had to kill that poor bastard. I. Well. You okay, darling? You okay? Oh. Abigail. Abigail. I don't feel so great. Yeah. Jack! Get out here! Now! Jack, get your butt out of here! Lord, what's happened? Mama! Careful, boy. Mama! <laughs> oh. Stay right there, the pair of you. Don't make me no widower now. Uh oh, uh oh, zombie time. <laughs> yeah, I know how to lasso. It's not like I haven't played this game before. Stay there while I deal with your half-witted son. <laughs> you both need to son. Come here, I need to lasso. If you act like a child, I'll treat you like one. Yeah, kids, act right. Or your dad will have to lasso you. <laughs> See, you'll end up like him if you don't behave yourself. <laughs> now, I don't know what the hell's gotten into you sick, crazy bastards or what I've done to you, but I'm going to get help. Stay calm. As calm as you can, seeing as both of you seem to have gotten a little excited. <laughs> Probably just a fear. 
Jack, be kind to your mother. Abigail, teach the boy right from wrong. Both of them. Stop biting chunks out of people. Be back as soon as I can. Oh yeah, I forgot, um, clothes? Yeah, I'm just gonna put a few like thousand boards here. It's like bam, 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 bam. Anybody else? Guess I best go find me a doctor in town. Yeah, totally in town. Yeah, no. totally not a zombie. Here, horsey. Horsey, get your butt out of here. Come on, bro. We got undead. Monsters. Yeah. I don't know. It's been such a long time. I think we had redemption. Let's go. Yeah, I know how to whistle for my horse. <laughs> well, I just played it, but. I'm not used to like the storyline mark markers. I totally didn't fall any follow any roads at all. Oh, here we go. This is the main road. Let's go. Oh, U stands for Undead Knight. Wonder what happened to these folks. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't even occur to him. He could be in some. I wonder what happened here. Mr. Marston, sir. What's up, bro? It's me, <laughs> Professor. What are you doing here? I thought you went back to Yale. Well, I did, but uh, I came back uh, for another round of research. <laughs> and now all hell is quite literally broken loose. What is going on? Well, well sir, I'm a man of science, a man of great learning, a, a thinker, a, a wise man. And I'll be honest with you, sir, I haven't got a fucking clue. Why well, ain't that dandy? Well, what should we do? Well, I suggest we try to find other survivors, band together, and find a cure. Or fight to the death trying. Well, well, that sounds great and all, but uh, but I'm uh, just peachy. But, but I'm not sure that I'm I'm not cut out for such shenanigans. I, I was thinking more that the speed of knots before writing a paper on the events from the comfort of my study. I'm a scientist after all, right? I mean, I I, I can't do much science if I'm some bloodshot dervish's lunch, can I? Much as I would like. Your sense of duty is very impressive, Professor. <laughs> I'm gonna search the back street for survivors. No, no, no. Be, be, perhaps staying with you would be safer. Uh, could, could you just wait a sec here, would you please? I, I'm going to wander down that lonely, deserted street and get my bag. Wait, you should stay with me, Professor. You haven't got a gun. Oh, no, no, it's okay. There's no need to worry. Everyone's already dead. <laughs> I left my stuff with Mr. Nastas. You remember him, uh, Indian fellow, dumb as bricks, but, but a good sort. Okay. I thought he got shot down the camp. Affirmative. A couple of minutes. Oh, this is. Is this before the ending? Yeah, of course. But how does he know? What's his. Oh, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> John Morris is just like, um, I think I'm gonna be heading out. Hello. Bye bye. What 
I didn't kill him? Oh! He's dead. You ain't eating me, friend! I'm out! Alright, come on. Come on, John Morris. Come on, man. Come on, man. There's an apocalypse going down, bro. You'd just be like, oh, I'm out of breath. Yeah. Oh crap. Wait, hang on, there's a way in the option. Uh I think that's it. Oh, wait, no, maybe it's... No, go eat! Oh, I got it! Go eat! No, go, go, um, dead, uh, red dead mode. You stupid zombie. Oh, somebody's got some Anyone here? Hello? Anyone here? Come out. It's okay. Come out. I don't bite. Bad joke. I mean, come out. They come my family, mister. And mine, I fear. I saw my mama rip my daddy's face off and drink his blood. And they were happily married 20 years. I'm sorry. Your mama was dead? I saw her walk up onto the porch. And then boom! She ate my daddy. You weren't you weren't a bad man, mister. You weren't. Sure, he liked to drink, but but he weren't bad. And sure, he liked the company of women, but he weren't bad, mister, he weren't. No one deserves to have their blood drunk. I mean, he knew how to use his fist. And if, if a woman spoke out her place, he reminded her of it and everything. And when my mama was dying, people said that he was lying with her sister. But that weren't true, mister, it weren't. But you said your mother was dead. Yeah, her and Mr. Braithwaite. He's been dead a year. And then yesterday, he walked up that street eating dogs. And he loves animals. All the dead folk. This is just kind of making me want to like puke my guts they out. Ain't happy. Just a little bit. It's a funny kind of salvation. All the dead folk. All the folk buried at the cemetery over by the churchyard. My God. I'm gonna go have a look. You wanna come? No, I already seen my mama. I don't need to see any more of my relatives. Here, mister, take this. If you can burn them, maybe you can put their souls to rest. Hey, mister! If you see my uncle Mordecai, you burn him. Burn him real good, you hear? 
Alright, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Every subscribe helps me out. And remember, keep gaming, guys. Gamer boy.